The Electoral Commission is hoping to register more than 1.3 million new voters by the close of the exercise, which begins from Tuesday, September 12 to Monday, October 2. The Commission plans to conduct the limited voter registration at its district offices, a move which has generated some disaffection from the political space. I wish to add my voice to those who have called on the EC to reconsider its decision to restrict the registration exercise to its district offices only. Acquiring a voter ID card affirms one's right to vote and access to a voter ID card should be easy and not limited by location. Every Ghanaian deserves the chance to exercise this democratic right. I strongly urge the Electoral Commission to facilitate the registration exercise in all its electoral areas to allow for easy access and a reduced burden on the citizenry in their quest to register. The NDC has, in a formal letter to the Commission, requested for the identification details, including pictures and names of the registration officials. And the former president says it is key to ensuring transparency in the exercise. We want to know when the names and pictures of the registration supervisors, registration officers, registration assistants and other officials for the exercise will be published at the district level as stipulated by the EC regulations. We have also requested information on the exact number and distribution of workstations, registration kits and other logistics to be used in the exercise. The exercise was announced by the EC ahead of the district level and unit committee elections slated for Tuesday, December 19.